Saudi Arabia's NEOM is the most high-profile and largest of the Giga projects currently being developed in the world. Its construction is now well underway, with significant development achieved since the last progress film was shared with the world in January 2023. The second video launched on October 11th, 2023, reveals rapid advancements in the destination's key regions. With more than 60,000 workers currently on ground, footage reveals construction progress on its different regions moving forward quickly, with major infrastructure projects like roads, utilities, and a hospital already built. NEOM will eventually have 10 regions in total, encompassing an area of around 10,200 square miles. Four of the regions have been unveiled so far. They are Trojina, the mountain ski resort, Oxagon, the octagon-shaped port city, the line, the mirrored megacity, and Sandala, the luxury island resort destination. Very recently, the developers of NEOM announced its fifth and newest region. Join us today as we unveil everything you need to know about the intriguing new region of NEOM. Don't forget to click on that subscribe button and like this video as it's the best way to support this channel. Reinforcing Saudi Vision 2030's drive for a stronger, more sustainable tourism industry, NEOM has just announced the development of its latest ecotourism destination. Let us introduce you to NEOM's fifth region, Lija, a captivating development nestled between rocks. Located in NEOM and steeped in history and mythology, Lija starts from the Gulf of Aqaba coast and its alluring waters in the west, then vines inland to form a magnificent natural valley carved between 400-meter high mountains that have been crafted over long centuries by the power of nature and water. Details on the new aspect of the development are scarce, though the plan is to include three luxury high-end boutique hotels placed at nodes along the winding valley. Lige's three hotels have been intelligently and sensitively designed by world-leading architects to complement the surrounding nature, operate sustainably, and provide distinct experiences. The project boasts an adventure hotel, an oasis hotel, and a wellness hotel. The three properties will include 120 boutique rooms and suites, with 40 keys at each. The Adventure Hotel, designed by Van Duen, comprises a series of stepped volumes that cling to the rockside, forming cantilevered terraces and swimming pools. The hotel is intended to provide a base for tourists to pursue rock climbing and other high-octane activities. Among its offerings will be a sky lounge, a wellness spa, and a sky pool. According to the architect, every building that is designed at Lija will be designed in respect and in balance with nature and the landscape. The Adventure Hotel will be followed by the Oasis Hotel, designed by Italian architect Cuccinella as a cluster of geometric formations rising from the rock. It will feature a mineral garden and hanging gardens, as well as an observation deck and a rooftop pool. Killa, of architecture studio Killa Design, will be creating Lige's final offering, the Wellness Hotel. It will comprise two vertical mirrored volumes facing each other and will have an entire floor dedicated to wellness. Rooftop pools will crown the mirrored buildings. Once developed, Lija will offer an extensive selection of refined experiences and activities, including fine dining and contemporary restaurants presented by world-renowned chefs. Wellness facilities and rooftop infinity-style pools across the three properties are also key features. Guests can also enjoy extensive guided wadi walks and enthralling hiking trails set in the valley's dramatic mountain landscapes, with mountain biking and climbing on offer for those looking for adventure. Guests at Lige's three hotels will be able to explore a hiking trail to the Trojina Ski Resort, which is also being built as part of the wider NEOM project. Aligned with NEOM's overarching strategy, 95% of Lige's expansive landscape will be designated as a nature reserve, blending innovative ecological design with construction techniques that integrate with the environment. No construction timelines have been published for Lige as of yet. The region is still in its developmental stages, and the press release does not specify the opening date. 
Meanwhile, satellite images and drone footage show how the futuristic Lang megacity is gradually taking shape with the excavation of a long trench. New visuals show ground preparations happening for the construction to begin. NEOM has also awarded a $2 billion contract for the construction of the Connector South Rail Line that will link its industrial city Oxagon with the Line City development. This transportation project will extend south from the line to NEOM City Station, passing through NEOM Bay Mansions, NEOM Bay Airport, all the way to Oxagon. A 75 kilometers railway line will be constructed as part of the project. Current projections have the line Smart City development ready by 2039. Construction at Trojina is also well underway as seen in many video clips released by workers at the site. Large areas have been cleared out in the mountainous area for what seems like the vault, the main gateway into the project. We also discovered some pictures of the Trojina construction site peeking through the mountains and snow. Exact information has not yet been revealed about what is first being built at the site, but they are most likely the resorts. Neom's industrial and manufacturing complex Oxagon is rapidly progressing as well. Progress videos show a large area being cleared and flattened for the construction of Oxagon. UK-based hotel group Yodel has announced that the 300 key Neom Yodel will be the first hospitality development to open in 2025 at Oxagon. Meanwhile, Sandala Island is expected to start welcoming guests to enjoy its exquisite facilities and exclusive offerings from early 2024. As Neom's first luxury island and yacht club destination, Sandala will provide a scenic gateway to the Red Sea that will become the region's most exciting and attractive tourism location. Besides Sandala, Saudi Arabia has revealed plans for another luxury island destination in Neom that will be home to the world's largest coral garden. Known as Shusha Island, it will feature a marina, hotels, villas, a beach club, and even an underwater museum and research center. Shusha Island is set to become a super luxury island hotspot, complementing the Sandala Island project. Beyond Lija, the Lion, Oxagon, Sandala, and Trojina, the latest progress video shared by Neom also captures plans for the $2 billion development of the city's already developing Neom port, with the first new advanced container terminal set to complete in 2025, representing a significant upgrade to the terminal that is already operational. Additionally, towards the end of the progress video, the company offers the viewer a glimpse into the world's largest green hydrogen plant, which is set to be operational in 2026 under the Neom Green Hydrogen Company. It should come as no surprise that the launch of Neom Airlines has also been announced. Saudi Arabia has officially announced that Neom Airlines will begin operating in 2024. Operations will begin from the existing Neom Bay Airport, before moving to the soon-to-be-built Neom International Airport. Operations will begin with existing planes, but the airline is planning to invest in ultramodern aircrafts from 2026 onwards. According to the information available, the future airline will fly supersonic next-generation aircrafts that runs entirely on hydrogen. Currently, the airport site boasts well over 1,500 full-time employees working on the project. As the Vision 2030 deadline approaches, Saudi Arabia keeps introducing new branches of development for Neom City with its various regions, technological advancements, and transport infrastructure. The new region Leisure represents a strategic step in the kingdom's commitment to diversifying its destinations. Saudi Arabia is pursuing the project in part as a showcase for contemporary urbanism concepts and with the interests of its burgeoning tourism economy in mind. Additional satellite components are expected to be announced later as the larger plan unfolds. It is still uncertain whether a project of this scale can be pulled off successfully within the given timeline, but it is surely interesting to see how Neom has been progressing over the months. We look forward to bringing you more updates in the near future. What are your thoughts on Neom's progress? Leave a comment below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.